Men on your side is getting answers from Hampton City officials about the police chief's sudden resignation. When Chuck Jordan quit, he said the city of Hampton and its leaders do not support the police department. Stephanie Harris caught up with leaders today at a special meeting. And Stephanie, how did they react to that accusation? Tom, first of all, no one expected this resignation, least of all the reason the chief cited. But the timing of all of this leaves a lot of people wondering. The city is in the middle of investigating a police undercover cigarette sting. When you see things that Chuck Jordan served the city of Hampton for 34 years. Tuesday, he served the city manager his resignation. I asked Mary Bunting and the mayor about Jordan's claim city leaders do not support the police department. I was surprised by that statement because I do feel that um, not only my office, but the council has been extremely supportive of all of our workforce, police included. You know, I can't comment on any personnel matters. I can just say that, you know, Chuck has served the city honorably for over 30 years. Um, he's made the city a better and safer place to live. An undercover cigarette sting run out of this warehouse was launched under Jordan's leadership. He shut it down when he heard a complaint that officers were misusing money for their own personal benefit. The city ordered investigations and Bunting put Jordan on administrative leave. She stated clearly it in no way placed blame or accused him of any wrongdoing. Likewise, Jordan said his resignation is in no way an admission of guilt. I'm continuing to search for the truth uh, despite his resignation. And, you know, as I said earlier, I want to get to the answers as quickly um, as possible, but to ensure that we're thorough. And as soon as I have those answers, I will share them with the public. Until then, Jordan maintains in his letter the undercover operation reported in the media was conducted within proper and well established protocols. When asked what she would have done differently, a clearly disheartened Bunting admitted information she shared with the media early on turned out to be bad. I wish that the um, staff I entrusted to provide that information had done a better job of checking information before they gave it to me. So I ask if anyone on her staff was disciplined. Bunting said that is a personnel matter. She's not allowed to discuss it by law. Same goes for City Council's closed session meeting this afternoon on police personnel. The council will meet again tonight. There will be time for public comment. That starts at 6 o'clock. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.